it's your girl Kayla. Welcome to welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Kayla. I'm 15 going into my sophomore year of high school. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to become a part of the K fam. But as you guys can see by the title today, I'm going to be doing a Sheen Summer Try On Haul. So let's get straight into the video. Ryan Little. <laughs> start off with accessories so the first thing I have are these hair clips so they're a cheap material which you should expect from Shein so I feel like they'll break pretty quick but they're cute to me and they come in a variety of colors for an inexpensive amount so next I have this pink bag it's supposed to be a waist bag but I wore it crossbody there isn't much space in here my phone barely fits in here and I have the 13 Pro Max I feel like the only thing you could really probably put in here is some lip gloss a wallet and some keys and you can just carry your phone around in your hand maybe but it's cute it's a good material and the strap is adjustable next I have this black corduroy material handbag slash crossbody slash shoulder bag whatever you want to call it but this bag is pretty spacious a 13 inch macbook can fit in this bag along with some books if you were to carry it at school and i feel like it's a really nice material next thing i have is the same bag just a smaller version in pink I don't have an iPad or anything like that, so I couldn't even tell you guys what size iPad can fit in here. But just based off of the other bag, anything smaller than a 13 inch MacBook will be able to fit in this bag. Next I have this black stitch hand slash cross body slash shoulder bag. Now this bag is actually really cute. I love it. It's spacious. I can put my iPhone in here, wallet, charger, headphones, lip gloss, glasses. Everything can fit in here. Now, don't try and overdo it. It ain't that big, but it's pretty spacious. Now that I'm done with the accessories, let's get straight into the dresses. So, the first dress I'm going to show you guys is this black backless dress. You guys, I really love this. This was kind of like a Skims dupe. This is so comfortable, so stretchy. I just love the material. It is so soft. The only downside to the beige version of this dress is that it's see-through, but I feel like that's really with any white or beige or cream dress that you get. So I just wanted to give you guys a heads up on that. Next dress I have is this dusty pink bodycon dress, I guess you could call it. This was also another Skims dupe. The material of this dress is kind of rough. Like it's not uncomfortable on, but it's weird to touch. Like it's a weird material. But this is also stretchy. And if you want to skim to do, just get this dress. Next dress I have is this white collared button up ribbed dress. This dress is so comfortable, so stretchy just see-through like that's the only thing about light dresses like this it's just see-through another thing about this dress is that it rises up when you walk but I feel like it already being short plays a huge role in that so if you don't want it to rise up I'd say size up maybe the next dress that I have is this green tank dress this is one of my favorite dresses out of this entire haul like I love the design Love the dress, love the colors, love the material. Only thing about this material is that it does not stretch. So trying to get it over your head is not really difficult if you got the right size. Now if it's too small, then you out of luck. It's a really cute going out dress, take cute pictures and all that. But I really just wish that it was stretchy. So the last dress I have in this haul is this white and black design type of dress. It's a backless dress for one. Yo, this dress is just so cute. Like it gives a body. It gives 
going out to eat with your homegirls or maybe your sisters. You want to take pictures, you know, go to a fancy little restaurant with your heels on, hair done. Maybe your makeup done, got you a cute little purse. Yo, like this dress is giving very much bomb. Like, I don't know about y'all, but I'm feeling it. But getting into the material, it's pretty stretchy. It doesn't rise up when you walk, so that's good. And I just love the back out. Like, pretty. Give a little back. Give a little shoulder. <laughs> now that we're done with dresses, I'm going to get into the sets that I have. So first, I have this short and blouse set. It's like a hot pink. It's so cute. I just feel like it's not cute on me. Like this type of outfit on me, I just feel like it's not my vibe, which is probably why I don't really like it on me. But I feel like it's a cute outfit. It's a nice material. It's versatile, so you can wear it down, wear it tied up, wear it off the shoulder. You know, do whatever you want. Match it with a cute little white top, cute little black top, depending on the color of the set. Some heels or tennis shoes, you know, you can really do whatever you want with this. And I think that this would be a great set to get if this is the type of style that you're into. The next set that I have is this dusty blue short and top set. Now, I don't really know how I feel about this. The shorts are too big. The shirt where the nipples are is just giving weird. Like, I don't know why they made it that way. Why it slits right there. I don't remember seeing that on the model. Maybe I did and overlooked it. But I'm just not feeling it. And then it's not very stretchy either. The last set that I have is a gray short and tank top set. Now I believe that this was another Skims dupe if I'm not mistaken. This set is so cute to me. Like I just love it. It's stretchy. It's a cute color. The bottom and top fit like you know how some sets the top be too small the bottom be too big or the top be too big the bottom be too small like the size that you order is the size you're gonna get but yeah it's very stretchy breathable it's a cute lounge around the house type of set and i'm i'm loving it now that we're done with our sets let's get straight into our tops and the first one i have is this white palm tree top with the slit down in the middle now this top is so cute so breathable it's a nice material so stretchy love the vibrant colors in it love the way it fit i just get this a 10 out of 10 like it's just so cute y'all next top i have is this long sleeve white button up top now this is a little tight on the sleeves but besides that i feel like it's a pretty cute top i guess it's truly a nice material nice and stretchy it is see-through I say that it is see-through but overall this is a pretty nice shirt next I have this white ribbed tank top shirt now this is the shirt that I actually paired with the yellow and pink set that I showed you guys earlier in the video this is nice material like literally so stretchy y'all if y'all get the wrong size like maybe a size down it don't matter because it's going to stretch to the size that you need. Like, that's literally how stretchy this shirt is. And it's so nice. Like, the material, oh my gosh, y'all, is so soft. So soft. Next, I have this halter top white and black squiggly line type of shirt going on. It has a little design in the back with, like, a crisscross. It's really cute, nice material. It's not really that stretchy. Like, it has a little bit of stretch to it. Um, it's not see-through at all, and it's just a cute top. Next, I have this brown crop blouse. Now, this is something that you would wear, like, on a cooler day of summer. The material is rough. It doesn't have a stretch to it, but the bottom of the shirt has, like, an elastic band going around the back, so if you need that space for the shirt to stretch towards the bottom, you have that luxury. Next, I have this black and white plaid shirt. Now, it's kind of the same situation as the last shirt besides the elastic goes around the entire bottom of the shirt and the material is a little smoother. It is not stretchy at all. It's comfortable, chill, something you can, you know, go out, 
with your girlfriends or something to the mall. You know, with your little day. Next, I have this gray and pink crop top. I had high expectations for this t-shirt, like literally. When I seen it online, I was like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. And I got that in person. But it's just not cute anymore. The material is cool. It's not really that stretchy, I guess. But this shirt really didn't meet my expectations. And the last shirt that I got is this white graphic tee. Now, I love the material of this shirt. Even though it's not stretchy, it is soft. And I decided I wanted to tie it up to spice it up a little bit. But you could obviously wear it down if that's how you want to wear your shirt. Now, y'all know it's not a haul unless I have some jackets. And even though this is summer, guess what? I still got some jackets because guess who still wear jackets in the summer? Me. So the first thing I'm going to show y'all is this cropped gray jacket. This is so cute and comfortable. It is a little see-through. But it is so soft, it's definitely not the stretchiest and it fits to you. So if you want it to be a little baggy, I'd say just size up. Next, I have this black cropped jacket as well. This is very soft, like so soft. It keeps you very, very warm. That's how thick it is. Like it's not too thick. And this is a nice material, a cute little jacket to throw on to run outside and do some errands or something of that nature. Next, I have this rhinestone blutter, 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 butterfly jacket. It is so soft, y'all. So soft. And I just love it. It's not too thick, not too thin. It's very comfortable when you put it on. I mean, what's not the love? Next, I have this green sweatshirt. Now, y'all, this is so soft as well. She really does their thing when it comes to creating soft, thick sweatshirts and hoodies that's very comfortable. Now, on to my last hoodie. I have this white hoodie with this red writing on the back. It says, love you every minute because you need to love yourself every minute. You need to love others every minute because you have to cherish every second. Like, you never know what's going to happen. And I thought it was just cute anyway, so I got it. And it is so comfortable, y'all. This is also another oversized hoodie. Like, as y'all can see, y'all already see the pattern. Oversized is my thing, okay? So now that we're done with our jackets, I'm going to show you guys skirts. So the first one I have is this blue velvet material ruffled skirt. And I also got it in green. This skirt is so soft, so stretchy. It doesn't rise up when you walk. I feel like it rises up when you sit, but I feel like that's pretty normal for a skin tight skirt. But other than that, I really love the material. The next skirt I have is this red ruched skirt. Now this one, if I'm not mistaken, does rise up when you walk and when you sit down. But other than that, it's pretty stretchy around the band area not really the actual skirt itself but it is a nice material the last skirt that i have is this white pleated skirt this skirt is actually really really cute i just feel like i don't like how certain stuff look on me like i don't like how this look but besides that the material is actually pretty soft but it is not stretchy so if y'all want to get this make sure y'all get the size that y'all need now that we're done with the skirts i'm going to get right into my shorts so first i have these gray biker shorts these are very, very comfortable. I love that it has a band at the top of the waist so that it does not fall down and feel secure to you. I also have these in brown. They're not the stretchiest, but they do have some stretch to them. The next pair of shorts I have are these PU leather shorts. Now, if y'all been a part of the KFAM and have watched some of my previous hauls, y'all know I do not have a great history with leather bottoms at all, especially from Shane. They are so funky, but these, they're not funky at all. They have no smell, to be exact. But these are not stretchy at all, so if you do want these, get them true to size. They're a nice material, but I definitely would not wear these outside in the heat heat because you will literally sweat so bad. Now, my next shorts are these drawstring gray sweatshorts. Now, y'all... I love these like they are so 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 comfortable I love that they're jawstring love the waist they're not too thin not too thick 
they're soft they're comfortable i need to go order these in different colors asap next pair of shorts i have are these denim shorts the denim is perfect material it's stretchy like when i say stretchy it's stretchy you know how some denim be real rough and no stretch now if you want some stretchy denim shorts get these they are really really comfortable you can wear these to the pool wear them to a party wear them to a pool party like <laughs> these are really just so cute and i truly love them the final pair of shorts i have are these light wash ripped up jean shorts these are also very comfortable the only thing is they don't have much stretch to them no i take that back they don't have no stretch to them okay but they are very cute so now that i'm done with my shorts we're going to get into my pants so i have these green flare leggings these are so comfortable they don't really have much stretch to them but the waist has an elastic band around it so it fits to your stomach they aren't the thickest but they aren't too thin so you know your legs won't be trapped in the pants you get a little breeze in them next i have these black leather wide leg pants now back to that fish smell like it just smells like fish like why can somebody please comment down below let your girl know why do leather items smell like fish but these pants are very very comfortable they don't have much stretch to them i feel like they're stylish you can style them up style them down next i have these light wash mom jeans y'all these jeans are so comfortable and so cute to me i feel like i should have sized down because they are a little baggy in the front these are really cute really stylish but really overall i feel like most of sheen's jeans are good if you get the right size next i have these light wash straight leg jeans with a rip in the knee these are very cute very comfortable the size that i'm showing you right now is a zero but i actually reordered them and got a size four because i felt like i needed to size up by two and the size four actually fits great so i really love these they're very comfortable love the detailing and the rips and i feel like they spice up the jeans a little bit more and the last pair of jeans i have are these cargo jeans now if y'all watch my old pretty little thing haul like i'm talking about old pretty little thing haul i loved cargo pants so for me to find baggy jeans in a cargo form you know i just had to get it so these jeans are very very comfortable have a lot of storage the pockets that you see on the side, you can really put things in them. The only thing is these jeans are very long. Like, I am not the tallest person. So that was the end of my huge summer Shane haul. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe and hit the post notification bell to become a part of the K fam. And also comment down below, let your girl know what was your favorite piece from this clothing haul and also comment down below let your girl know if you guys want me to start doing lookbooks like with the outfits complete instead of me sitting down and showing you piece by piece because i feel like that would kind of be a cool little thing for me to do since i never tried but yeah just let me know down below and also follow me on instagram y'all can dm me on there if y'all have any questions or you can comment them down below either way you'll get a response from me so yeah i think that's pretty much it Thank you guys for watching. Bye.